hey guys welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here you're welcome my name is Juliet and in today's video I'll be doing a 2 one video first of all I'll be trimming my hair I have some dead end that I need to get rid of and also I'll be doing a twist out so for now I'm just going in with my spray bottle to spray moisture water basically it's just water in the spray bottle all over my hair and then once i'm done with that i'm going to go ahead to section my hair into two different sections so i'll be starting from the back and then walk my way to the front so the two products i'm going to be using today for the twist out is the african pride moisture miracle shea butter and flaxseed oil moisturizer and defined coiling cream and also i'll be going in with the african pride gel and cream basically it's also a call defining it's a call defining gel and cream also basically these two products have um they have the same ingredient they have shea butter and flaxseed oil but i really wanted to go in with something that was more of like a gel consistency just to be able to hold my hair so first off i went in with the cream before i realized that i was going to trim my hair so basically i'm just combing out the edges of my hair basically like the ends of my hair and then i'm mapping out the area i want to get rid of you know for a while now, i've really not been happy with how my hair is looking i feel like it's supposed to be fuller i don't know if it's just in my head but i've been you know i've been thinking about cutting my hair off like doing another big chop and letting the hair grow out again but i don't know but I'm going to give myself some time and just try to maintain my hair better and see how everything goes so right now i've gone in with the gel basically i focused most of all these products on the on the ends of my hair because i felt like they needed them but as i went you know as i went higher as i progressed with the trimming and the cutting i, be I began to apply more of the product all over the the whole hair although i still focused more i was more precise or more um what's the word i'm looking for i was more into the ends of my hair i really focused the products on the ends of my hair but i still applied them all over the whole section of the hair making sure that everything was well absorbed so basically that's what i just did from there i continued to do the same thing all over each section of my hair I will pick out the section I didn't really use any cutting comb to like do a precise pattern or anything I was just you know grabbing the section I wanted trimming off the dead ends and then going in to twist my hair so basically that's what I did and then when I get to the ends of the hair after twisting I just call my I just call the remainder of the hair around my fingers so you guys you can see all the dead ends you can see like i had a whole lot of breakage i think i cut about an inch if not more than an inch of hair not really sure but i really cut down you know some of my inches because i just felt i had like too many splits and um too many knots and tangles so with this i felt very um optimistic about the hair and you can even see just by bringing out that you can see there are so many um, I have a lot of breakage yeah that's the word I have a lot of breakage so I'm really looking into um, growth regimens for my hair like following a precise regimen and seeing what that's um, what the results comes turns out to be like maybe in the next six months or so if you guys have recommendations for me please leave it down in the description box I'll be happy to go through all you guys suggestions but for now i'm really looking towards um just um doing more protective styles and like leaving my hair to just do its thing i think i've really been um doing so much with my hair of late i'm not sure i don't know if it's that or maybe if it's the protective styles with the with the um attachments you know the braids and things like that so so guys focusing on the product the coiling cream and then the coil defining gel and cream they both basically have like the same products which is flaxseed oil and shea butter i think maybe the proportion of each of them might just be different in the boats ingredient because the one in the tube has more like a gel like consistency and then the coiling cream is you know a cream 
but yeah they both have flaxseed oil you know flaxseed oil helps to you know it provides natural hold and restore shine and then shea butter it deeply moisturizes and helps to strengthen and protect the hair i really wanted something that was um that had like a gel like consistency because it takes a while for the ends of my head to actually um to hold the coil basically so i wanted to go in with a gel so that was why i went in with this and i really focused both products on the ends of my hair and whatever that was left i took all over the roots of my hair even coming forward to the front section i think i went in with more products than i did at the back section so basically the gel on its own decides a three-in-one curl training system which helps to define curl pattern it molds and holds shape and also it hydrates and adds shine i don't know about the you know um what is it called because it says yeah, it defines and elongates natural coil and coil patterns i don't know about the elongation but when i applied the gel at the tips of my hair i could see the you know it's helping my curl pattern to form and also holding it down so the curling cream basically was just like you know it, it does what a curling cream would do i believe because the twist came out very like juicy but yeah everything was really shiny so yeah guys basically that was all i used in achieving this twist out i'm going to leave this in for about two days to air dry and then i'll be back to show you guys the finished look so guys i'm back <laughs> it's been two days so basically i just unraveled the twist out i kind of lost the clip where i was unraveling it but yeah this is the finished result so now i'm just going in to separate the curls to give myself more volume you know more poof. so once i'm done unraveling the curls from each section i'm going to go in with my white tooth comb to give myself even more volume because who doesn't like volume especially on the first day it's such a shame because you know we're just at home and i'm not you know going anywhere with this it's just going to you know go to waste but yeah it's fine so basically i'm just going to style this into a fringe hairstyle you know when i was younger i never used to like fringe hairstyles but look at me now so yeah guys basically this is all for this video i really hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to give me a thumbs up like comment share and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys